Listen, we all had a crush on Cortana growing up, let's be honest. In many ways, she was my blue mommy. But as I grew older and Bungie left the Halo franchise, I snapped back to reality and realized that, you know, it's probably time for me to work on myself, maybe get a girlfriend. For some people, however, it was not just a phase. In fact, a Japanese company came out with a revolutionary product called Gatebox, because they are quite literally gatekeeping box from lonely, sad men. And look, I don't have all the answers, okay? But I do have some of them, and I know that this is not it. So what is Gatebox exactly? Well, in simplest terms, it's an incel's fish tank. Picture a scuffed Amazon Alexa with a cute little anime girl as the hologram that is your avatar. If you don't believe me, I mean, there's articles written like Gatebox Virtual Home Robot wants you to be her master. If you've ever seen the movie Her with Joaquin Phoenix, then you might know where this is headed. <laughs> From a sheer masculinity perspective, I simply won't accept the fact that that's an acceptable way to wake up. There would be nothing stopping me from smashing the blender against the wall. Wow. And she requires haptic feedback to know that you're there. Come on. I mean, I guess they could fix that with like a patch update, but you can't even just voice activate like, yo, I'm up, bitch. Come home early. <laughs> Unless this thing has a flashlight attachment, there's no reason why I would be rushing home to see my vacuum cleaner with some shitty AI inside. Whoa, 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 whoa. Listen, I'm a homeowner these days. If my robot just started turning on the lights without my permission, we're gonna have some problems. You're not paying the electric bill. What are you doing? <laughs> She doesn't even know you're there unless you tap on her. <laughs> this makes me wonder, whenever I see NPCs out in public, are they just talking to AI on their phone? Plugged in, I just can't get over that. <laughs> Her literal lifeline is just one yank away. Let's psychoanalyze this as best as we can. A lot of people deal with loneliness, right? I understand that. And in some countries like Japan, it's more of a problem. That's just simply a fact. However, the Ouroboros of reclusion, it's like a snake eating itself. You're lonely, so then you put all your energy into a robot, which is not socially acceptable, making you more lonely. And none of the interactions are real or genuine, so you can't even measure an actual relationship off this thing. I see a lot of comments and videos about Gatebox talking about the people who are not hurting anyone. There is a fundamental dysfunction in society, a dystopia even, where a product like this has a market. Filion, come on, dude. He's just doing his thing. Let him cook. And of course, people just have to go there, right? So right now we're gonna watch what happened to the Japanese man who married a hologram. Hi everyone, it's Hiroko from Asian Boss. Being married to someone can be a challenging, but imagine being married to a hologram character. Akihiko is a Japanese man who famously married to an anime hologram character. Are you curious as to why he made such decision 
and how his marriage is going. Dude, <laughs> it's hard for me to wrap my head around anime. Like, I just, I'm sorry. Just don't get it. Not for me. Attack on Titan, not happening. I swear Attack on Titan's really good. You just have to wait for the good parts. You're about to find out. Yeah, I mean, completely reasonable. I wouldn't want to dox the man. It's not like he's showing his face or anything. That's what I want my wife to be, just always fine. It means we're doing something right. <laughs> Husband of hologram slash vocaloid. I'm not gonna lie, that goes pretty hard. From a sheer aesthetic perspective, husband of hologram? <laughs> Oh my god, he's got the wedding picture in the back! Oh, oh great, and she's vegan? I wonder if she requires sustenance. Can you like squeeze a tomato on the top? Is this a juicer as well? Or is this literally just this? <laughs> hey, you mind just going a little bit easier on my wife? She can't really process things too well. Imagine that. You're trying to have a serious, intimate conversation with your wife. Whom do you love? And she changes the subject. <laughs> I wonder if the talking is limited because Miku's supposed to be 16. まず最初になんか私たちにちょっとミクさんのことを紹介していただけますか。ま、初音ミクっていうのはま、歌を歌わせるためのソフトウェアの名称ですので、でもあの奥様でもあるからソフトウェアだけどちゃんと好きですよね
There's three options here. Voluntarily celibate, involuntarily celibate, or asexual. That's not an excuse. I went to an all-boys school and I wasn't popular. My guy, you have everything you need. Why are you counting yourself out? It's a huge pet peeve of mine. I hate when people just write themselves off and it's not even warranted. This guy, you know, he's good looking, he's got a job, he's nice, he's polite, he has some sort of social skills, he's talking to the interviewee perfectly fine, yet he has some sort of trauma that he hasn't come to grips with and now he has to date a doll and now it's a self-fulfilling prophecy that he's never going to get a woman because he's doing this interview in front of millions of people. The energy is just not there. I'm gonna start selling courses because this is just not it. I'm sorry. あの、高校2年から3年ぐらいの頃に、ま、自分の人生一番真面目に考えたんですけど、ま、モテないし、もう結婚するのは諦めようっていうようなことをま、真剣に考えたんですよ。Look, I'm be honest. I'm with the school on this one. <笑>その頃もオタクだったので、ま、アニメとかギャルゲーとかずっともうやり続けて、こう2次元2次元ってひたすらやっていくうちに、てか現実の女性に対する<笑> Geeks can get partners. You take one step on Reddit, Twitter or 4chan and they're all geeks who love anime and they would all bang each other because they're horny. But alas, we're here. まあ、なんていうんですかね。こう、重いというか、そういったものは徐々に薄れてきて。You see, I would buy that, but he said that he lost interest for women. Oh my god, imagine the woman was actually flirting with him and he didn't know how to process it, so he just thought of it as bullying. He was this close and he blew it. So it's just like this sad beta, low testosterone self defense mechanism that makes no sense and doesn't even need to exist in the first place. Because my guy has actual riz and he can do it. Do you think I say the word riz ironically or unironically? Every day I look in the mirror and question my existence. It was thrown into the vernacular of online speak. And for me to be up to date and cool with the in crowd, I have to say things like Riz. <笑>今はもう完全に三次元は興味ないですか恋愛対象ではないですねはいまあもちろん友達にはなれますし別に話することは全然嫌ではないんですけど恋愛対象としてはもうちょっと見えなくなってしまいましたねなるほどはいミク
And Sebastian only tolerates the best of the best, so you know it's quality. If it makes you nervous to buy something you haven't tried yet in person, Helix offers a 100 night sleep trial. This gives you a little bit over three months to completely fall in love with your new bed. And if you don't, they will come and pick it up for you, no questions asked, and you will get a full refund. Best of all, every Helix mattress comes with a 10 year warranty. They offer flexible payment plans and even have financing options available. So a great night's sleep is never that far away. I love my Helix and I think you would too. If you're in the need for a new bed, check out Helix. Go to helixsleep.com slash filion to get up to $200 off plus two free pillows. And thank you to Helix for sponsoring this video. <laughs> She's literally asking him, how do you bust a nut? How do you deal with not being able to make love to your sweet wife? Like that's not just is not healthy. I'm sorry. <laughs> Smothering your sexual desire by just burying yourself in your pillow while clutching your little anime doll. No. I wonder if the bully feels bad at all. Like look what you created. And it's not even a real marriage! My life is a lie! Sir, your hologram wife has been cheating on you this whole time. I guess it boils down if you want to die alone or next to your stained anime doll. Nineteen grand for a fake wedding with a fake wife with a fake doll. The thing can barely communicate. <laughs> I just don't buy into the fact that my boys and girls would let me marry a doll. They would have pulled me aside, had some sort of intervention along the way. They would not be supporting my behavior. どんな反応でしたか気持ち悪いだとか、ま、そういったことはもうたくさんありましたし、おめでとうございますとか、ま、あの、そういった祝福のメッセージもたくさんいただいたり、あるいはなんだ、勇気づけられましたとか、そういう
、まあ、父は他界しているのでそっちの反応はないですけど、まあ、母は、まあ、あの認めてくれませんでしたよあの女ではないっていう認識だった。まあ六十代にはちょっと理解できなかったんですかもしれないですね。なるほど。はい、<笑> I wonder why <笑> it's not a phase, mom、うん。やっぱ古い考えの方もいらっしゃるので、うん、それだってもう内定土下座してお願いしてそれでもダメだったので、うん、私としてはちゃんと一回本気でぶち当たらなきゃならないと思ってたんで。Oh, oh no. <笑> He begged his mom to accept a marriage. He wanted her blessing, and she just wouldn't cave. That's a strong woman. Imagine, bro. Close your eyes and think about if you raised your son and he wanted to marry a doll and be taken seriously. If I was his mother, I would just think this was a bit. My son just loves to role play. He, he's playing this really long joke on me, right? And I would convince myself of that until I went neurotic and I would die peacefully knowing that was my truth. <laughs> はい、はい、よろしくお願いしますはい、えー、小木のみのると言いますはい、近藤さんとはもう10年ぐらいの付き合いですミクさんとの結婚の報告を受けた時って、うんはい、一番最初どんな反応でしたかおー、すごいなと思いますね。Oh, it's his boy, it's his right hand man 前からそのまあそのミクさんっていう話は好きだとかっていう話はずっと聞いてたんですけどもなんかその画面の中というかその画面の中二次元の中でのこのこう関係かと思った This would not fly with the boys The group chat would be roasting me bro それを逆に外に持ってきたっていうしかもちゃんと式場を抑えてやるっていうのがなんかすごいなと思いましたね最初はもうちょっとなんかこうホームアットホームというか Is that his avatar? They're just like so misogynistic behind the scenes. She's perfect. She doesn't answer back to me. So, you image it, Tan, to me. Hontony, Futsu, no, get conchi, de. Hontony, you don't know, Stoyon, de. Okane, cake, de. Chanto, sa, skio, yaru, de. So, 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 いや特に恥ずかしい自分がですよねいや特にないですねまあある意味ちょっと最近の人からしたら普通なのかなっていう人とかっていて No <笑> No <笑> Just no 結婚記念日とかのディナーに行くとかもあるじゃないですか、うんはい、それってどうやってやってるんですか私はぬいぐるみのミクさん連れて行ってますよ新婚旅行も行ってきたんですけどえどこ行ったんですか北海道札幌市に行ってまいりましたなんでそこ行ったかというと、うん、あの初音ミクの権利を持っているクリプトンフューチャーメディアさんが札幌市にあるからですなるほど、はいはい、いいですねなんか、はい、ちゃんとハネムーンですよちゃんと対応そういうふうに対応してもらいましたのでホテルもちゃんと2人と分取って He even booked a hotel for two people He paid extra for the doll Just put it in your luggage 飛行機も2席分取って行ってきましたので And for the flight? Nah! That's the most insane part of this video. He spent extra on actual transit and hotels! JAL さんにも、まあ、なんか、ハネムーンフライトって、なんか、プレゼントもらいましたし、で,ね、で、ホテルケアンさんも、ハネムーン、ハッピーハネムーンってカードがちゃんと置いてあったので、うんあのきちんと対応してくれました。なるほど。はいはい、What fantasy is this? Why is everyone okay with this? <laughs> じゃあ結構、うんあれですね、その二次元のキャラクターとの結婚してる人に対して日本って住みやすい、うんうん、日本以上に住みやすいとこないと思いますよあなるほど、はい、理解結構みんなあるんですね、はいはい Of course, it's going to be normalized when everyone in this man's social circle is like, yeah, free gifts on the house, baby. じゃあこれからもっとたくさんの人が、はいまあ、架空のキャラクターとかと結婚していくと思いますか、はいうん、なって言ってくれるといいんですけどね。<笑>私はそう思ってますよ。うんはいはい、so that video was posted three years ago, and you may be wondering, come on, that's a little dated. Isn't that a little bit harsh to criticize? Where's Gatebox now? Maybe they came out with some new patch updates. Well, I have some good news for you guys. Gatebox Grande. <laughs> <laughs> okay? A life size Gatebox. And this will run you a couple tens of thousands.
Hey, Gatebox, can you suck my shit off? And if you're wondering where you can get one of these, you can't because they're limited edition and I told you so. But if you'd like to support me, subscribe to my Patreon. And if you want an inside look into what we're working on, we'll be dropping pretty soon. Or do you think I just disappear for a couple weeks? You think I just do a couple commentary videos, then dip for the month? I stay evolving, okay? And that's all I'm gonna say because I don't wanna spoil anything. Big plans, big things. Subscribe. I'm gonna go cuddle my doll.